It's so cold in here, I feel like my heart is in a freezer. All I need is love to warm me up and maybe a Killy Laro. Shall we talk about it? Let's, Let's do this. Today we had the opportunity to watch second rehearsals for mini acts, among them San Marino's Stripper by Achille Laro. I don't even know where to begin with that, Katie. Would you like to begin? Yep, um, we were both truly lost for words, I would say, at the performance. Um, it is genuinely, I've, I've seen nothing like it. There's leather, there's glitter, there's camp, but also it's extremely dark. It's, I mean, it's amazing, but yeah. They're really How did it make you feel, Katie, watching this clearly mm. pure sex performance? Yeah, made me feel a lot of things. <laughs> <laughs> um, yes, it definitely um, made me need a fan and a drink of water after watching it. Um, what about you? You know, I feel like everyone in this press room was just on fire after yeah. watching this performance. Yeah. Um, we saw, I think, I wanna say we saw maybe some green, which we haven't seen in this performance mm -hmm. before. It opens up and there's a good amount of fog. We know that a lot was put yeah. into the staging here. But there were several moments for me that really just stood out. Mm -hmm. When Achille and Boss Doms come together, I do believe they've worked together before, if, if I'm not mistaken, but they just have this amazing energy and chemistry that they share. Mm -hmm. And what they share just the energy and chemistry, it makes the performance, it makes the staging that much better. So they come together and there's this moment where Boss Doms is just up against Achille and so it's Achille is holding him up. And then, you know, the song continues and Achille walks away. He goes towards the wee wee pink bull. Achille mounts the bull. Boss Doms has hopped down a step and there's and he literally gets on his back it's as though he is in the bridge yoga pose now we yes. haven't seen yes. that happen yet let's go back to the bull back to Achille he has mounted the bull and it's as though Achille is going to ride this bull the back and forth motion of riding the bull and he rides Think the bull to the beat of the song as well <laughs> Yes, his writing is synchronized mm -hmm. with the music. And then the camera goes back to Boss Doms, who is in position. He is in this yoga bridge pose. We see him grinding in sync with the music also. And we realize that Achille is the bull and Boss Doms is enjoying the bull. I this was just so well done the whole story plays out so well so let's talk about some other things in the staging um you still have the the cages on the side that look as though they are diamond covered cages you've got a drummer to the right you've got the keyboardist to the left and this is one where in just watching the TikTok, you really couldn't tell what was going on it ends with Achille on the bull, but if you watch the TikTok, you think he's gonna be there the whole time. Yeah. Um, I think there was a concern in the TikTok as well that the bull might be a bit tacky, but this is, even though it's raunchy, it's got a class about it, I would say, and it's effortless in its, you know, star quality. Um, it's not it's not something that's maybe memeable. It's, it has, a, it's got, class it feels expensive i couldn't agree more it's one of those things that you just want to watch from start mm -hmm. to finish and then you want to watch it from start yeah. to finish and then again you want to watch it from start 
to finish. I really couldn't get enough of this performance. Yeah. All three rehearsals mm -hmm. I found absolutely, positively riveting. Yeah. So Katie, do you think that we are going to see Achille Laro and Boss Doms and Stripper performed on the Eurovision Grand Final stage? Without a doubt, there's no question. The entire press room were on tender hooks. There is no way this isn't going through to the final. What about you? I can't see how this possibly yeah. could not go yeah. through. It is just so OMG, yeah. for lack of a better word, that mm -hmm. if you are watching this for the first time, as many will the evening of the grand final, I could actually see this winning. I looked back to see where we were. In 2017, we had a ballad. 2018, yeah. we had pop. 2019, we returned to a ballad. 2020, we had Moniskin. So if we followed that pattern, you would think that a winner might be something a little bit softer, but I am getting winner vibes from this. Maybe yeah. that's just me manifesting my blood moon <laughs> rising over this performance, but it was stellar. Yeah. So It's art. It's pushing boundaries. It's something that I think we're going to see on Saturday. Absolutely. That's what we think. We want to know what you think. So please don't forget to like, follow, subscribe, share, comment. Mm -hmm. And follow us on Pinterest. All the social media platforms. Devin mm -hmm. manages Pinterest for us, but we're on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. We have podcasts on Apple, podcasts on Spotify, a new Discord channel. We're here in the Press Center every day on the live stream. We want to visit with you. Thanks so much. We'll see you later. Bye!